Hey you! Thank you for clicking on this video. My name is Julian and welcome and welcome back to my channel. So guys, today, based on the title, we're going to talk about 7 ways to look bougie and expensive. And before we even start, bougie and expensive comes from within. So if you, deep within your core, you know that you're bougie and expensive, even though you don't have money, then so be it. You are. Without further ado, let's go straight to the first. Your posture. How do you look when you walk into a room? The way you carry yourself, the way you walk, the way you talk speaks a lot about yourself. When like you walk in a room, there's an aura of confidence that you exude and someone can say, yeah, that girl, that girl looks bougie. That girl's look expensive. So walk, change your, change your posture. Don't walk as in, even when you sit, sit like someone who's like elegant, change change your posture change the way you talk change the way you look and all these things come from even the way you dress which goes into our next point is work on the way you dress like for me i know i like to invest in very unique pieces i don't like to wear clothes that like you'd find with everyone that's why i love thrifting because i believe with thrifting you can find like really good elegant pieces to like elevate your style another thing is monochromatic fits guys you can never ever you can never ever go wrong with a monochromatic look be it personally i don't have color i'm not yet invested in color in my wardrobe but that is something that i want to invest in so like have like a mo ma i've i've discovered that one of my favorite colors is like purple having a monochromatic purple look mono go, lo go like for like neutral looks monochromatic brown looks beige looks monochromatic looks is where it's at like you will wear a monochromatic fit and trust you me you're gonna look so good you're gonna look bougie you're gonna look expensive another thing number three to look bougie and expensive is accessorize guys accessorize i know you'll come at me and tell me oh accessories are expensive but kwanza in the in this era of tiktok where Every Tom, Dick and Harry is sharing like shops where you can get affordable jewelry, affordable rings, affordable earrings. Make you, you, can be, you can be wearing a very basic, very, very basic outfit. But when you put jewelry on it, when you put some rings on it, belts, a belt on it, earrings, automatically the outfit is elevated. So guys, accessorize, accessorize, accessorize. <laughs> Yes, another thing that will, another tip for you to be bougie and expensive is like makeup. Makeup, you you don't have to be a makeup guru, guys. You don't have to be a makeup guru. Just go for a clean makeup look. Again, if you're interested in how, learning how to do a clean makeup look, I've done a video. I'm gonna link it down below in the description box. So please make sure to look to look at that video to know how to achieve a clean makeup look. Clean makeup looks like. What I have right now on my face, this is a very clean makeup look. It's like, it doesn't involve a lot of things. It's just do your eyebrows, your eye. You even don't have to do a liner. And again, if you look at my liner, it's very, it's very minimal. It's not like the exaggerated liner. It's very minimal that if you're a beginner, you can be able to achieve this look in like 10 minutes. So invest in clean, learn how to do like a clean makeup look. Just foundation, eyebrows, a lippy or gloss. I now nowadays I'm I'm gravitating towards red lippies. I've still not yet invested in some, but it's in my bucket list. I want to invest in like some red lippies. I think just red lippies are it. If you get like a really really good red lippy, guys, red lipsticks they just elevate someone's look red lipsticks are it you will look you will look like you have money even if you're broke as fuck yes invest in red lipsticks. like clean makeup looks another tip that i want to share with you is get your nails done get your nails i don't know about you but for me there's just something there's just something with with getting your nails done you just feel like you're a different person you just feel like put together yes go make make your nails you don't okay we are doing this on a budget in town if you're in nairobi in town there are places that do nails for as low as 500 shillings if that is a little bit of a stretch for you you don't have to like even just 
having your nails just plain but they are clean they are well shaped you can get a well it, that speaks a lot about you speaks a lot about how you carry yourself how you treat yourself so always have your nails done don't be the girl who's walking around with chipped nail polish like because that mimi that that is one thing that really pisses me off not pisses me just no why are you walking around with chipped nail polish that's that is also one thing that makes me not i'd rather if i if like i can't afford to do my nails at all at all i'd rather just keep my nails clean and just have them like that rather than doing nail polish because nail polish tends to wear off really quickly and i don't want to be that girl who's walking around with chipped nail polish how no so invest in making your nails just it can be a really simple thing you can do it yourself but just put some effort let your nails be looking good another thing that i also want to talk about is hair you don't when i'm talking about hair when i'm talking about really really extravagant things you don't have to like have the 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 latest human hair wig or you don't you don't have to do wigs but just let your hair look nice because let me tell you when someone looks at you for the first time the first thing they're seeing is your face the first thing is they're seeing is your appearance and that speaks a lot so make sure your nail doesn't have to be extravagant make sure your hair is done even if like you don't have braids you're not doing it but at least there are very cute natural hairstyles that you can do so make sure don't 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 allow yourself to have a bad hair day if you're stepping out yeah do something to that hair make it look good make it look nice another thing that i wanted another tip to look bougie and expensive it's not something that people see but it's something that people can smell invest guys invest in how you smell invest in how it doesn't have to be it doesn't have to be like those really really expensive perfumes okay everyone wants to have expensive perfume including me yes i agree but if you're not there yet there are other alternatives there are the alternatives for like cheap perfume but it really does the job it doesn't have to be like that cheap perfume that everyone knows about but if you look around you can get something within your budget that can work for you that smells really nice yeah make sure you smell good there's something there's something about your smelling good that that makes you look bougie mm -hmm. yeah and that's the vibe that you're trying to hmm? that's the vibe that you're trying to to to, to give people exactly <laughs> so guys that is the end of the video feel free to share down in the comment section below some more tips that you use personally that help you bring out the bougie and expensive vibe again if you want more of this video please also tell me down below and if you've reached this far thank you so much i love you and please don't forget to like please like the video subscribe if you haven't we want to get to 400 subscribers help me reach that goal i will highly appreciate and yeah that was the end of the video i'm gonna love you and leave you see you in the next one bye